Hi everyone, this is Alicia, also known as ADP60685. I know today is only Sunday, September 23rd, 2018, but I thought I'd do my weekly topic a little bit early this week, since I don't know what's going to go on this week. Um, So far, I don't think there's anything planned, but this week I thought I would talk about one of my favorite, favorite chores. Now, everybody has a chore that they really, really enjoy more than any other. My chore is actually laundry. Laundry is my favorite, favorite chore. Let me give you a little bit of a background on how that got started. When I was eight years old, I was over a special church member's home at the time, and she was doing the laundry at her house. And I said, oh, that looks really, really easy. And she says, you mean you don't know how to do laundry? I said, no. And she said, well, why don't I teach you how? And so that basically started me on my lifelong journey. Since then, for 25 years, I have been doing laundry. I can do the ironing, I can do the carrying it out onto, say, the clothesline where you hang clothes outside on these heavy duty type wires or ropes and you hang them outside to dry when the weather's warm. When the weather's colder, you normally use a dryer. I have used basically any kind of laundry product there is, the cheap stuff, I've used the expensive stuff, I've used the in-between stuff. I've also used laundry soap in the liquid form and the powder form, and I've also used it now in the laundry pods, which are a little bit bigger than my two fingers put together, so it's about the size of a small bar of, say, chocolate. And so basically... I know how to do laundry using portable washing machines, which I currently have. There's also ones that you go to use at the laundromat. There's also ones that you use in your homes. I basically have used any kind of washing machine there is, and I still love doing laundry. The only things I really don't like is if you have, say, a pair of blue jeans and you have to squeeze it out by hand and you have to wring it out. That's really a pain in the neck but I will do it. I also don't like having to do it with a lot of bleach because when I was doing laundry, it made me break out into a terrible rash, which I have somewhat of a rash, but this is not because of bleach, but this is basically a heat type rash. But I get a rash similar to that when I do too much bleach and it makes me very, very itchy, it makes me very uncomfortable. And that happened when I was doing laundry for my mom where I was literally doing four loads of white aprons, white polo shirts, and that was very, very tedious for me, and it made me break out in rashes, but I can do laundry, I don't mind doing it, everybody's like, ew, I hate doing laundry, but me, laundry I absolutely love, I can do ironing, in case you didn't know, yes, I do iron, I've ironed, where I started ironing when I was about 14, maybe 15, where I had to iron my JROTC uniform on a weekly basis. I don't like having to set up the iron board per se and taking it back down, but I don't mind it. It's just, that's the hardest part, is just setting it up for me. I don't mind having to go back and forth with the iron. That's no problem. But when people see that I love doing laundry, I will go with them to laundry mats. I'll do it at their homes. I do it for family members, I do it for my mom and me. I'm actually doing laundry as I'm talking right now. But like I said, I absolutely do love, absolutely love doing laundry. Laundry is one of my favorite, favorite chores. I would do it all the time, every day if I could. So I get samples in the mail and say, this is a good product, this is a bad product, this is an in-between. And basically... Since I'm the one that does the laundry, I have to let my mom know when I'm running low on supplies. One little tip that I've learned, too, about the dryer sheets. Now, after you have the dryer sheets and they've practically all the scent is gone, but there's still a little bit left for maybe the most a week. After that sheet has been dried up and everything, I will store that into my drawers and it makes my clothes smell good. And it's really, really a cheap way to make things smell really, really good and clean until you can get the next load of laundry done. Basically, once that dryer sheet gets a little bit 
frayed and stretched out where you can't get any more smell out of it, then I would throw that in the trash. I don't keep it forever, no. But that's one thing that I've learned about doing laundry, that I can do that. And so, I hope that tells you guys a little bit more about me and my life, that I, yes, love doing laundry. I mean, people say, nobody ever said that they love doing laundry. Me, yes, I would love doing laundry. I really do. I would do it all the time. It's really, really easy. My portable washing machine, I really, really love because I can do a load of laundry portion within 15 minutes. The dryer portion, I put it in and it does it within 5 minutes. So it doesn't take that long. And it also drains the water so I don't have to squeeze it out by hand. It has a portion on the portable washing machine, a setting where it says drain, and it drains the water out from the washing machine. So, <laughs> like I said, I'm really, really excited. I love doing laundry. That's one of my favorite chores, and that's my topic for this week. All right, bye!